Hey guys, today we are going to design a curve beam like this. Application of curve beam is that uh, you can see the arches. So there is a beam which is curved. Okay. So let's start. File new space name what you want. I'm gonna think curve beam. Make sure your unit is meter and kilometer. Next. Add beam finish. Okay, I assume that my height of column is five meters. Press control and the length of beam is also five meter five and five. Okay, close it. You can see fine. Now click on geometry, add beam, and add curve beam. With clicking on this, we can add the curve beam. Okay, so this is main point of this lecture how to add the curve beam. So for adding curve beam, click on geometry, add beam, and add curve beam. Fine, so click on this, choose two nodes mine is this one and this one. Fine. Now, two options are comes radius of curvature and gamma. We are going with with radius of curvature. So mine is radius of curvature is say five meters. Okay. Okay. See, curve be added. Okay. So now design and draw, analyze at same. Which I have also shown in my first or second lecture. Let's repeat it. Click on journal, support, create, fix, add. Click on support. Choose these two nodes. Assign. Okay. Property. Fine. In 3D rendering, you can check. Fine. Okay. So support and property are successfully assigned. Go with load. Load case. Add. First is dead load. So dead load. Minimum this load is DL. Add and second is live load. Name this LL. Add close. Dead load add. Self fit add close. Live load add. Number load. I'm gonna do assume that the load on beam is 10 km per meter. Okay. Add close. Okay, self rate assigned to view, and this UDL will be at on beam. Okay, assigned to selected beam.
Okay. Again, design column, add, close, design column, assign.